How was the last hundred bites that came in? I was hungry. I grabbed a snake. Why would we stack? Let us know where you're close. I'm really not doing this on purpose. I'm sorry. Toughest opponent the last three weeks, Snickers, they're fishing. They can, can you put your thumb on the bolts as to why some of these things that have been happening are just decided to happen in back to back weeks and your two biggest games to be from? Um, honestly, I really, I really can't you know, put a grass on it. I don't, I don't know what it is, but um, no, I'm not, I'm not worried about it. You know, this is a resilient team. You know, this is a tough team. And, um, we've been through a lot. You know, you win some, you lose some, unfortunately. But, you know, that's the game of football. And, uh, you know, like I was telling the team in the locker room, it's, it's not over for us. We got a lot to do, and a lot to still work for. You feel like the Coastal's still there? I mean, it's, like it's not in your hands anymore, but you feel like it could conceivably still be there around you guys? I think so. Um, you know, I'm, a, I'm one of those guys that's always going to be positive. And, you know, be energetic. And, uh, you just got to look forward. You know, just continue to move forward, really. Maybe composure is the wrong word, but when you've got three big special teams wonders and all of a sudden, you know, seven nothings, twenty-one seven, kind of like that. How is it? How tough is it to sort of stay in the moment on the sideline? Um, what I was doing, I was just talking to my guys, you know, and uh, saying I did a great job of just trying to compose everybody. And you know, at, at that point in the time of the game, you just need guys to, you know, show their leadership and show their poise and you know, just try to encourage everyone else around you because you know it, it, it's tough. It, it's tough coming to back from from those uh, turnovers and those you know, unanswered points and all that stuff. And, you know, that, but that's the job of you know, the leaders on the team. You know, that's the job of me and, and Shane and you know, the, the senior position leaders on the team as well to just you know, try to have everybody just stay poised. Just I don't think this team needs to get mad. Um, I think what we need to do is just stay in the bunker and do everything that we've been doing. You know, just do it better. And, you know, execute. I thought we were well prepared for the game, but we knew what they were doing. Obviously, the Virginia Tech is a great defense. Um, you know, they had the same coordinator for a long time. Everyone was comfortable with that defense that they run. Offensively, you know, they're a great team. And, you know, from the outside, everyone looking in, it makes it seem like, you know, turnovers and all that stuff is a problem with their offense. But they're a great team. Uh, Logan Thomas is a great quarterback. And uh, he showed it tonight, and, and you just got to give him credit. Steven, from your perspective, Offensively tonight for you guys, what you what you see? Offensively, when we were on the field, uh, I thought we did okay in some situations. We need to stay on the field more on third down. We can't be in third and long. You know that, that's almost impossible to to convert. But um, overall, you know when we had to score, I thought we did a good job of scoring. Um, we just need to do better at our first down efficiency on second down. And, you know, the big plays will take care of themselves, but we just need to focus more on the little things. You talked about this team being resilient. You've got Duke coming up, which I believe if it wins its next three games, completely playing in the ACC title game. So they're, they're a threat. So do you guys feel like you can bounce back from this? And well, every team in the ACC is a threat regardless. Every team that we play is going to be a threat for us. Um, obviously, Duke's had an unbelievable season so far. And uh, you know I know that. It's going to be a great challenge for us. I haven't really watched any film on Duke. Unfortunately, I was you know, just getting ready for this game. But I, I know that they have a real good hot streak going on for the last couple of weeks. And on top of that, you know, they have a great coach, well-coached team, well-disciplined. Uh, you know, they do the right things at the right time. You know, you know what to expect from them. So it's going to be a tough game, no doubt. And, um, you know, our job is just got to get back on the course. I do want to say to, uh, to Coach Golden and to uh, David Case, thank you for the new uniform. I'm uh, surprised no one said anything about it. Uh, that's about it. So. Good night, y'all. Thanks. Thank you.